We are going to challenge you with ingredients that are much harder to work with. Natasha chose the most amazing, stunning, beautiful, long-listing. Jesse, let's go. Bring me some form of redemption. I have no idea how my langoustine's cooked on the inside. I won't find out until they're cutting into it, and that's nerve-wracking. What is in here? What am I looking at? I did it some pureed tail and some shiitake mushrooms and rainbow Swiss chard to go with it. A fried langoustine? And you can see, I mean, it's perfectly coated. Perfectly seasoned. Really good. Awesome. Great Thank job. Thank you so much. It's beautiful. That, for me, is one of the best longest things I've tasted. Really good job. Wow. Jessie's definitely on my radar right now. I'm definitely keeping an eye close to seeing what her weaknesses and strengths are. It's the winning dish. And this person will, like Jordan, become a team captain in your first real field challenge. This individual took lots of risks and it paid off. The winning dish belongs to, congratulations, Jesse. Great job. Our bus arrives at Emperor Elementary School as the students begin their morning studies. The best home cooks in America are about to get a lesson of their own. <laughs> All right, guys, 18 home cooks on time and ready for class. <laughs> Let's go, guys. Come on. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning, Good morning, Chef. Morning. Welcome to your very first MasterChef Team Challenge. In a couple of hours from now, you will be cooking for the most picky eaters on the planet. Your challenge today is to provide a healthy, nutritious lunch to over 300 elementary school children. Oh. I have never in my life cooked for large masses, uh, let alone 301 kids, so I'm in for a roller coaster today. Each team is responsible for one entree and a dessert. You'll have just one hour and 45 minutes to prepare and cook your lunch dishes. And then 90 minutes to serve each and every child here. A delicious, healthy, nutritious meal. One they'll actually want to eat because they're the judges today. <laughs> the losing team will, of course, face their very first pressure test, where at least one of you will be expelled from MasterChef for good. Understood? Yes, yes chef. Jesse and Jordan, you had the best two dishes in the last elimination test. You will be today's team captains. Starts now. Let's go. In this team challenge, the red and blue teams must now create a healthy menu for the elementary school students. The meal must contain a protein, a starch, a vegetable, and a fruit. All right, guys, veg-wise, we've got cauliflower, green beans, corn, Brussels. No greens, no greens. No greens, kids hate green. Corn. OK, no greens, so corn is sounding good, right? I'm depending on my teammates to know what kids like. They all said their kids don't touch greenery, so we wanted corn. We didn't want green beans and broccoli. So if we did chicken like teriyaki, it could be all cooked, and you have it in sauce, so it's hot. We're cooking for kids. We're not cooking for us. Yes. Right, we'll make it super simple. Rice and chicken. All right, go ahead. Go, whatever it is. Uh, fruit dessert. Let's do strawberries. 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 Kids like strawberries. All right, we know what we want. Despite some objections, Red Team Captain Jesse has decided to go with chicken teriyaki, corn, and a strawberry crumble for their kids' lunch menu. While on the blue team, our home cooks head in a more conventional direction. Pasta, pasta. Yeah, we have pasta. Why don't we do turkey meatball? We got whole tomatoes? Yeah, we got whole tomatoes. Whole tomatoes. I'll, so I'll make you can do a gravy? Our... We got green beans. Yeah. You think we can make green beans work? Yeah. Yeah. Definitely, yeah. definitely. We need some sort of fruit. We got apples? Yeah, we got Granny Smith. I'll make an apple crisp. I think it's straightforward. Spaghetti and meatball menu is going to be awesome for kids. One, two, three. <laughs> Boys and girls, please gather around by the side of the bus. It's 
like impossible to call. I can't tell if like we slaughtered it or if we bombed it because our fate's in their little tiny creepy hands. Let's go, guys! The students gather to vote for their favorite team. Will they choose the blue team's pasta and meat sauce menu or the red team's chicken teriyaki and rice? Boys and girls, you are now the Master Chef judges. On the count of three, I'm going to ask you to run into the square that cooked your favorite food for lunch. Was it the red team or the blue team? Come on! Come on! Come on over! Are you all ready to vote? On the count of three, one, two, three! of the votes and the other team scored 42 percent the winning team is red team This has been like the best week ever for me. I got to be team captain. We had a great team. Everyone performed so well, and we won. Yeah! Oh my God, yes! The theme of today's elimination challenge is stuffed or filled pasta. In the pantry, we gave Eddie three different kinds of stuffed pasta to choose from. Eddie chose... Agnolotti. Jesse! So, the filling, what's inside there? Oxtail and short rib with just a little bit of the chicken filling. Here's the thing. I mean, the pasta's beautiful. Uh, the filling is seasoned stunningly. And I think there's a target on your back because everyone thinks you're in this competition because you look good. Um, you're in this competition right now because you cook good. Never forget that. And again, that has proved it. Great job. Thank you so much. Good job. The best dish of the night had incredibly delicious filling. The balance of textures worked perfectly. It was almost as good as her dish. And that dish belongs to... Jesse. <laughs> Chrissy and Jesse, you are now team captains in the up-and-coming challenge. I've been team captain twice. I've never been defeated as a team captain. This is awesome. What a great advantage. I'm a force to be reckoned with. For today's lunch, the blue team is serving a spicy Latin fried chicken with a jalapeno ranch sauce, while the red team is betting on a traditional southern buttermilk coating. Hello. You gotta get me some of that chicken. Yeah. For the salmon entree, blue team is serving a balsamic marinated salmon while the red team has an Asian soy glaze. And for the vegan lasagna, the blue team's version has a spicy tomato sauce, while the red team's has a pesto sauce. I really like that. I'm the only vegetarian in the competition, Are so you? thank you for trying that. Thank you. Of the 127 souls fed, one team received 90 votes, and the other team received 37. And the winning team is... The Red Team! I'm ecstatic because, for one, it's been the coolest challenge ever, being on the set of Glee. And we won by a huge margin. Thank you for picking a good 